Hello again, it's Mark Suderman coming to you from Fresno County. It is October the 23rd, 2015. We're standing in one of our treatment blocks. These are Okitsu Wasi Mandarins. And they're harvesting now. But what I want to do is just show you how things are progressing. What we're seeing in this block is a really uniform ripening. And so our maturity is really nice. About a month ago, we applied three gallons of 21717, and we've done that for a number of years. And what it does is just helps ease the amount of gas that's necessary as they ripen. But also what we find is it puts the finishing touches on the size. Now during bloom, these received an Ultra Grow full program, and that puts emphasis on plant-ready P and K. But in the fall, we tend to put a lot of focus on what our tissue needs are and how we came out of the year lacking. We want to address those traces. Maybe it's boron, zinc, manganese, whatever those things are, we address those on a case-by-case -case basis. One thing we're dealing with this year that's a bit of a challenge is we've set such a good crop, and this is true in the whole industry, we've set such a good crop that it, we're struggling to get it all to size. Now while we did what we needed to do at bloom time during that window of cell division to maximize that effect and stimulate that, when you set a heavier crop, you got to feed more. I think that's true about the whole citrus industry this year regardless of the crop. We've got drought and lack of water and poor water quality playing into the mix and creating an end result that maybe isn't close to even what we had planned, but we still got to deal with it. So if at bloom time you put on the right nutrition to stimulate a lot of cell division, come about a month to six weeks before harvest, you can do a lot of good to help put the finishing touches on a crop, especially if you're concerned about that finishing size. And also, the more you can improve the maturity and the bricks, the less gas you're going to need and the better your fruit's going to hold up come shipping and for better shelf life. So keep in mind when you're getting closer to harvest and you've got a size issue and the challenge is going to be to get it to size up better, you can do something about it with a good nutrition plan. Get your CCA's help and they can guide you. With a good plan and good plant-ready nutrition, you will have success.